Hi guys. guys and welcome back to our YouTube channel and another travel series. If you're new here, I'll introduce myself. I'm Jess. I'm Tom and today we are off to Florida. Yeah, can't, what? can't wait. Absolutely buzzing. Again? If you're new to the channel, obviously you wouldn't have seen our last video that we put online and that was a reveal video. So I did a surprise trip for Jess. Mm -hmm. You had no idea about this at all. No, I had a week last a week. week to get ready, guys. You can imagine the stress this week. Yeah, it's been a bit of a crazy week, hasn't it? It's but been fun. <laughs> today is finally our travel day. So we're heading down to Heathrow shortly. Yeah. Our flight is about 3.40, I think. Yeah. So it's a bit of a late one. We are leaving quite early. It's actually only just gone half eight. Yeah. Um, we're leaving really early. We're a couple of hours from Heathrow. Yeah. Um, and it's a Saturday, so. Yeah, it's just so one we'll of them. just give us loads of time. And then if yeah. we want to stop at services, we can on the way yeah. and just take it leisurely. Yeah, that's, that's no it. No stress. Like we can just get there and just relax as yeah. opposed to sort of doing a few things here now, leaving a bit later, getting caught in traffic or whatever, you know, worst case scenario. I'd rather just get there early, we'll get, get there early, there, settle yeah. down, maybe grab some food and stuff, yeah. start our, our food travel binge off in, a, mean, in good style. For the last week, obviously I've only known a week, we have not stopped talking mm. about snacks. No, we haven't. No, food. Can't wait. Corn dog nuggets. Exactly. <laughs> so this is why, you know, this is exactly why we're vlogging. One, for memories and two, to bring you guys along and show you exactly what we do get up to when we're away. So if you haven't seen our last series, by the way, go back and watch it. Yes. But the thing with the last series, and I always say this to you, when we travelled to Florida last time, we actually flew down from New York because we went to New York for five days and flew down to Orlando. So our last travel day wasn't really like no, a full-on travel day. It was fake. Yeah, it was like a fake travel day. It was fake. Obviously, it was Impossible. internal. It, it was a great flight, by the way, that one. That was amazing. But today is a oh, full... Oh, I definitely recommend it. Yeah, this today is a full travel day from the UK from over, over to Orlando. Over to Orlando. Yeah, so premium it's going to be... Premium economy. Yes, yeah, premium economy today. So it's going to be good fun. So we're going to obviously bring you guys along. We're going to leave literally in about five minutes. So yeah. whether we pick this up on the way, we probably will. We'll probably yeah, talk we'll on the way. Me. So uh, yeah, we'll give you yeah, a little bit more info. Actually, one thing, One thing you don't know, though, is obviously where we're staying. If yes. you ever watched the last video, you'll see that Jess has no idea where we're staying. That's going to be a surprise, so you'll see that later today. And uh, I'm really excited to see Who's your hoping face. for Yacht Club? Is it just it's, me? It's, it's, <laughs> yeah, it's not Yacht Club. Uh, I wish it was. But yeah, now it's going to be good fun. So we'll bring you guys again along to show you exactly where we're staying. I did mention in the last video as well, the reveal that we are doing Halloween Horror Nights as well. Yeah. So we've got all that to come. And you said that you've booked some reservations. Yeah, reservations. I don't yep. know anything. Yeah, there's a couple of surprises to be fair while we're away. So it's going to be great to obviously reveal those surprises when we're away. But yeah, we're going we're gonna to head down there now. So we'll see you guys probably on the way or at the airport. So the cases are all in. We are all good to go. So guys, we have made it to South Mims. Yeah. We, we haven't quite made it to the airport yet, but we wanted to stop off, didn't we? We're quite early. We've actually had a really good <laughs> run down, so. Yeah, it's been so smooth. We might as well just stop. So we've stopped. Cheers. Yep, for a coffee. Much, uh, well needed, certainly. Yeah. We did actually have a coffee this morning. At home. Yeah, we got up early, got the dog out, dropped the dog off, and then obviously got ourselves set to, to come down. Does anyone else cry when they drop their dog off, or is it just me? Yeah, and me. Yeah, we you both cry. <laughs> now it's always sad leaving her. I hate leaving her. I always feel guilty. But we've gone also for some breakfast. Oh yeah. So I have gone for the signature breakfast sandwich from Starbucks. So, and I went for yeah. the cheese and ham croissant. I really wanted Burger King, but it's not breakfast. It's just it's normal it menu. Look, it actually looks all right. <laughs> Does it? It looks quite nice. Yeah. It's just needed. It's definitely <laughs> I'm needed so at hungry. this point. But yeah. So we're about. I think we are about an hour from the airport now so yeah. it's not too it's not too far but obviously we're gonna have this we're gonna settle for a little bit i've actually got a little bit of work to catch up with so i'll quickly do that and then we're gonna head down there and then go and do bag drop or whatever we're gonna do mm. and then when we're in the airport we're gonna look around probably duty free have a look around for some of the shops maybe 
whether we we probably won't eat in there now now we're eating this but obviously we get to eat we get to eat on the plane so but we might eat we'll have to obviously we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get there i'm getting a chicken royale after this but yeah we are uh, super super excited mm. but a little bit about this trip compared to the last trip so if you watched our last series you'll see we didn't actually go to universal or islands of adventure that's because we booked the trip on as an extra wasn't it after new york so we didn't go and do that because we stayed at Disney. We just stayed at Disney and went to Disney parks. Since then, if you're familiar with the channel or familiar with our socials and stuff, you'll know that now we do have annual passes and we've purchased annual passes for both parks. So on this trip, we are staying at, we're staying at Disney, but you don't know where yet, but we're staying at Disney and then we are gonna head up to Universal as well. But we'll walk you through all what we do every single day on the journey. It's exciting. And you've booked some, do you want to tell them about the reservations that you've booked? Because I don't know what they are. Do you want to know what the so reservations are? So shall we all are? find out today? Yeah. So the reservation, like, I must admit, because we booked it five weeks ago, or six weeks ago now, the reservations to get them is very, very mm. difficult, certainly on the very popular restaurants. So the restaurants that we have booked, you've one of booked. them, one of them I booked is Via Napoli. And there, <gasps> there's a certain, yeah, there's a certain time with that. Oh. And I will walk you through what that is. I can't really say about that now, but I will walk okay. you through the plan around that. But I can't explain that now. Sounds a bit crazy, but I will walk you through it. It will make sense later, trust me. We'll all find out together, and, guys. Yep. And the other one we've booked a breakfast for is one you really want to do, and that's Tusker House. <gasps> yeah. And we haven't done that one before. Oh my god, no way! So is it? We've got really, a reservation for that. Yeah, really. Oh my would, god, buzz him. Yeah, we do really want to try that. Oh, I'm and the other one I really want to book, and I can't seem to get a reservation, and I try my best. And well, I don't try my best. That's a bit of a lie. <laughs> but I have tried several times. Is I think it's Ohana. Mm. I really want to do that. Yeah, we really want to go there for dinner. Yeah, and loads of vlogs we watch. People always go there and rave about it. and It looks amazing. So we are going to have a look when we're out there to see if we can maybe grab one. Yeah, we might be able to grab a one. reservation. Like sometimes you can. Yeah. Like we check the My Disney Experience app when we're out there normally just yeah. to see if anything pops up. Just so to see if it does, yeah. It might do. Like that would be amazing if it does. If mm. it doesn't, it's no biggie. No. How's your sandwich? Mm. Very nice. Very My, good, very nice. Um, croissant is very, very tough. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. It's fuel. It's what we need. Need for a long day. These days are so long. Like again, we were up at up about five, half five to sort five, like, yeah. the dog out, find a bit to pack him, drop the dog off, and obviously to come down here. But it's it is literally such a long day. I think by the time we land, I think we land at eight o'clock their time. What? So that'll be it's around eight o'clock, I think. So by the time we're at the hotel, it's going to be so late for the UK. We it's have be long, like we have got such a late flight. Yeah, we have, yeah. Usually we'd fly, so actually with that, usually we would fly earlier on the day. There was no flights available because because I booked it quite late. Mm. There was only the afternoon flight, so we, we booked them anyway. Usually what we would do as well, if we had an earlier flight, is stay the night before. Mm. And I'm a massive fan of that, and we would always do that. So actually, part of the reason why we probably left so early is because we were a little bit anxious maybe about... I'm not a very We want to just get there. Like, yeah. I am... Um, I think of all the worst scenarios that can happen that never do happen. No. But like so far, it's been like amazing. We've had a the great journey down. down. Been like it's been really smooth. There's been hardly any traffic. But I'm, yeah. a, I'm very much a worrier, and I worry stuff is going to happen, and we're going to miss our flight, and this is going to happen, and that's yeah. going to happen. It never does. Nah. But I always like to go the night before because I think if we're there, we're there, and then all we've got to do is make sure we get to the airport. Yeah. That day, I don't exactly, like travelling. Yeah on the same day but because our flight no. is later it gives us no just point a bit in a hotel yeah it just gave us more time to, to just travel down the day it just made sense but yeah we would usually get a hotel night before then you can wake up and it is very um stress free and it's very mm. relaxing very similar to why we have left early today just to make sure we can get here get set and then obviously uh, take that stress away so we're going to finish these up now anyway finish these up and then carry on with our journey so we have actually checked in online so that's all done but we are going to go into the terminal obviously to do bag drop and stuff yeah. like that and then walk through all the shops How like we mentioned how easy is that though like bag drop you just literally print your labels and off they go yeah so it's so convenient and again with our vlogging we are still new to vlogging it's still our first ever video went up about four months ago so there's still so much for us to learn yeah it's still so much for four or five months something like that but it's still so much for us to learn like we're still we're still learning quite a lot with it but we are certainly more comfortable now with it i'd say we don't mind getting the camera out anywhere we're not really scared anymore no we are sitting outside at the moment yeah we are actually sitting outside 
It's really noisy in there. Yeah, it's really noisy. The music's really loud. You probably won't be able to hear us. And we've actually come outside. It's and lovely. it's lovely out here. So if I if I spin this round, what you'll be able to see is so in there is where all your restaurants and that are. There's like KFC and there's Burger King. Mm -hmm. um, and then behind us, it looks lovely. I never even knew this part was here. And we've stayed we've stayed here. We've stopped here a few times. And yeah, I never knew you could actually come out here. I think this is actually part of Pizza Express, but Pizza Express isn't open, so we've come out here and made made use of it. But you're a little bit disappointed actually, weren't you, in there, because we got these, our breakfast, which is, is, is ideal because we're starving. Got our coffees and everyone that knows us knows we love Starbucks, so that was perfect. But actually Burger King did open as we got here and I know your your face lit up, didn't it? Because you absolutely love, literally loves the hash browns. And then we went over to the menu and there's nothing on there. So we can't actually have that. There's no breakfast. Like. Yeah, so that is very frustrating, but it is what it is. Like, it's just one of the ones. We'll have to save ourselves for the snacks. We'll have to save ourselves for all the snacks when we're away, all the treats. I mean, there's enough snacks. Yeah, I can't wait. I've been dreaming about every item of food the last five, six weeks. It's been <laughs> ridiculous. So, yeah, I, I can't wait to don't get. I don't know how you kept it so quiet. I don't know. Can't wait. Can't wait. Can't wait to get my Disney on. And get, my mum. Get you our ears too. out. <laughs> yeah, I know. Kept it. Secret squirrels. Yep, secret squirrels over here. But what else uh, have you been planning behind my back? <laughs> there's a couple of things. There's a couple of things here, but we will speak about them more when we're obviously when we're over there. So looking forward to it all. I don't know what I did to deserve this either. So. No, it's pretty crazy. But hey, we are all done with that breakfast now. We are. Car? Yeah, we're back in the car. So we're gonna head down to Heathrow now. It is about an hour, so hopefully, hour, so yeah, good. hopefully it's as smooth as what the drive was to here. Hopefully it's as smooth as that. So yeah, we're gonna bring you into the airport and show you around in there as well. We've never actually flown from Heathrow with Virgin. Last time we traveled from Heathrow was with BA, so it was a different terminal. Yeah, so it we, was actually, you're yeah, right. Yeah, so it'll be interesting to see what this, it's like. This time we're going to Terminal 3, aren't terminal we? Terminal 3, so yeah. The, well, Tom booked the car park. Yep, yeah, booked the car um, park, it's all sorted. It's all sorted, so yeah. Yeah, we'll I think, terminal three. yeah, when we, park up then we have to get on a bus i'm not sure how long that's going to be but obviously we'll, we'll find out um but yeah i'm gonna head down there now We have made it to the car park at the airport. Thank God for that. That was actually a pretty poor sort of drive, I would say. Certainly from the services to here, oh, you'll see traffic. a few. Yeah, you'll see a few of the clips. The traffic was horrendous. It actually did come to standstill at some point. But this is. Yeah, it's, it's one of the reasons we left early is in case this does happen. Obviously, it has happened, and we're still here. We're actually here. I think it's four hours early. Yeah, we've got four hours <laughs> until we fly. So. They do say obviously get here three hours before, but we're here four hours before, which is great because obviously we can get in, get settled, and like I said earlier, maybe do some a little bit of work or whatever. But there's a plane taking off behind us. <laughs> don't know if we're to see that. Maybe I don't know. I can't quite see it on the camera, but we're now going to uh, wheel our way over to the bus stop, which we is seem, miles away. Yeah, we seem to have parked literally in the furthest part of the car park, but it's all good. We can get our steps in that way. So uh, yeah, we're going to wheel over there now and then get ourselves into the terminal. Yeah. So quickly while we're waiting for the bus we thought we would actually do a very important critical part of the whole journey and pretty much what we have to do every day when we're away and that is the outfit of the day okay so starting with the shoes zara kids cute i do love these they are some nice ones yeah adenola uh, and evening and then i've got and my jumper that we got in April. Lovely, isn't it? Yeah. Lovely outfit. Thank you. Perfect for travel day. Yes, it is. Tom is joining in on the outfits of yeah. the day. I, I know. 
last trip I didn't do any of these. Yeah. I actually had a few of my mates message me saying, why don't you do it? <laughs> so I'm here, I'm here, I'm bringing it in, bringing it in strong. But yeah. today's hoodie of choice, it's a new one, isn't it? You got me this for my birthday? I did, yeah, 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 for your birthday. I haven't actually worn it yet, which was what, two months ago? But it has been, it has been summer, so it's fair enough. But it's an essential hoodie, which is lovely, oversized. Underneath I've got oversized night top, <laughs> standard. The bottoms are actually Under Armour, and these are so comfy. They're like cargoes, aren't they? They're so comfy, and the best thing of everything I'm wearing today are these trainers. They're Air Max Dawns, however, comfiest shoe ever. You'll see I wear these a lot, but these are actually ladies' shoes. <laughs> yep, I'm not... I, I don't care about that, they're fine. They're comfy, they fit well, they're, they're comfortable to walk around the parks with. No, it's perfect, you know, I don't care for ladies. They're unisex in my eyes, so yeah, yeah. nice and fresh. Don't know how long they'll stay fresh for. We'll give it a go. Not when you drop that cheese sauce on them. Yeah, these will be yellow by the end of the holiday. <laughs> So we are in duty free, looking through the aftershaves. Jess, you've actually found yourself a new perfume. A new Gucci perfume. Looks nice, doesn't it? Yes, yeah, well, it doesn't look nice. It? Well, it smells nice, that's what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> it does look amazing, by the way. So now we are checking out the sunglasses. What are you thinking, Jess? You need to get any? I don't need them, but I would like some. I definitely do need to get a pair. I purposely packed one pair instead of two so that I do grab some and there is quite a few here I'm just being super fussy but whatever I get I'm gonna have to show you guys I have to basically get a pair we'll find the ones we want out but we could be here for a while checking all these ones out I want some with some really thick frames yeah but I just don't think they're super safe right so I think it's Operation Sunglasses it's not going too well for me but I think for you yeah, you are absolutely loving it, and yeah. There's quite a few you actually do really enjoy, isn't there? <laughs> they are good. I'm really annoyed actually because I can't, as much as there is many here, I'm just so fussy when it comes to sunglasses. But I am thinking I might just get some when we go out there. Sunglasses, is it Sunglasses Hut? Yeah. What are those? They are huge, aren't they? Oh, they are pretty crazy, them ones, aren't they? Look like you're going skiing. <laughs> Tom finally found some sunglasses. We've been searching for quite a while. <laughs> They're perfect. Successful. How would we have passed those in that scene? All we saw was perfume. So the operation purchased some sunglasses was actually failing massively until we found the Ray-Ban store and uh, managed to purchase some in there. I will show you guys what they are. Uh, they're really, uh, really nice. <laughs> Making me look nice and pretty. Oh, you already but, are pretty. Well, I try, I try, I try daily. But yep, so we've just taken a seat now, just to relax. I think we've got about 40 minutes until the gate's up, is it? Uh, what is the You'll time? Probably... Uh, it's 22.2, so yeah. yeah, we've got 40 minutes. But yeah, 40 minutes. I mean, I must say, like, to have free at Heathrow, it's not got very many eating places. Nah, we've actually stopped um, off at Hoops to grab chicken wrap. <laughs> chicken family. some crisps as well. Nothing major, just to tide us over until yeah. we eat on the plane. Because we don't actually know what we're going to be eating on the plane. No, we don't know what food we're going to get. And I think you can look, like, but we just didn't... Oh, we didn't I think you can look through the app, I'm not sure. Or if you go to choose a certain meal with... If you've got allergies and stuff like that, you might oh, have I to see. then yeah, select food. Yeah, so yeah. I don't really know uh, what they're going to be serving. But I did actually see on previous vlogs that they do like a nice chicken tikka. Looks actually quite nice, so fingers crossed we'll that see. we get that. But yeah, it's obviously a long flight, so we're going to get some food on board now. 
We haven't actually purchased any water or anything, have we? No, but I was hoping to I want to fill my water bottle up. Like, uh, maybe at the toilets, there might be a fountain. fountain I'm going to go and look because I need the toilet anyway. Yeah, do that. It's just, uh, it's just such obviously a long one, so we're just gearing ourselves up for it. But yeah, Ooh. the gate will be called in is it 40, minutes? 40 minutes. Yeah. So then we'll head on down there. And then when we're on the plane, obviously, we'll show you around everything, show you what it's like in premium economy. Again, we've never flown premium economy no, with we Virgin. We have done yeah. with British Airways, and, yeah. and that was good. But uh, it'd be great to obviously compare the two and see see how they are. But yeah, we're looking forward to it now. And we're looking forward to obviously getting there. I'm hoping when we're there, we're, we're not... There so late. I hope when we get there, we're not too tired. You know, because I want to get there, and you really want to... Certainly with where we're staying, which you still don't have a clue. No. I really I hope... Find out? I, I really hope that we are feeling okay to explore a little bit but I can't obviously say too much but it's going to be great so we'll get there and get set but obviously it depends hopefully the flight takes off on time obviously we're yeah. going in a week as well which if you're watching this back in a few months time or whenever the week that we are flying three or four days ago is when the UK airspace went yeah, down there was loads of so the UK airspace. yeah things have started to pick up and also the time we are going out to Orlando, they've just had a hurricane, so we are probably a. Um, pro it was kind of touch and go actually. Like at the start of the week, I was looking yeah. at it, thinking, "Are we actually going to be able to go?" But obviously, we're here, so fingers crossed. Everything takes off on time as well. Other than that, we're going to eat this food now. Eat and our then, sandwich. Yeah, yeah well. and then pick this up on the on the plane. So the gate has been called. We are on our way. Yep, gate. 36, yes, I think. 36. There's me looking at 26. It's miles away, guys. And I'll end guys. up in... <laughs> I don't actually know where that away. says. Yes, but I think it's down the other end. <laughs> but we've got it, and we're we're having a casual walk down. We're not stressing. Like we said at the start of this whole video, we want to take it easy you know, and be stress-free. And thank God, so far, it has been like that. Touch so, touch wood. Hopefully the flight takes off on time. We land there on time. That's all we want. Does it feel real yet? No. Nah. I can't believe it. Yeah, actually, it doesn't really... I don't think it ever hits me until I'm kind of there. And then when I'm there, even then I'm thinking, is this real? So it's kind of weird, isn't it? Mm. It is a strange oh, Tom, one. Have you, have you shown everyone your Mickey Mouse impression? What one? I've got many. Not, not the one with <laughs> the ears. We know that one. Oh my gosh, sorry. sorry. I just nearly killed my gay. <laughs> she's just, she's, she's, oh, she's just, my just, just beating up her new suitcase. <laughs> uh, what, what would Minnie think? Oh, <laughs> Uh, I, I don't know what one you're on about. The, the voice. What one? What one? Wilson. Like, I, I don't know. I think you made that one up. <laughs> I think you made that one up, Jess. You've got shy. I'm going a bit red. Maybe, maybe I have got it. <laughs> Tell you what, yeah. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll save it for the mouse when I see him. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And actually, yeah, we do plan on seeing him tomorrow. Hopefully. That should be good. Yeah, but we're going to just go and find our gate now. Yeah. And then head, head, on, head on to the plane. So we have made it up in the air, 
Oh. Yeah, we have. I don't know if you can hear us too much. We'll have to obviously watch this back after just to see. Yeah, it's but a bit noisy. just quickly, the takeoff was fantastic, amazing. But there's hardly anyone on this plane. It's so quiet. Like, well, certainly in premium economy, there's, there's hardly anyone. Room. Like if I just because like, yeah. these two rows, these two rows here in front no of in front us front directly of us. No and behind, behind us. us. Yeah. So it's, there's no one near us. It's amazing. To be as loud as we want. Well. To a degree, <laughs> but yeah, now the takeoff was nice, yep. and we've had some great service so far. Yeah, our first there snack. Are. There we go, Just got it. I've never had them before. I don't know what they are, but they look nice. Yeah, I've never actually had them before, they look all right. Got prosecco. So yeah, we're gonna tuck into those. A couple of orange juices, actually, some prosecco and some water. <laughs> but orange juice. Yeah, yeah, I did, yeah, I did. Health and all that. What we're going to do now is Jess is going to just run you through this whole area yeah. because there's so much on the screen and there's a cool tail cam that's amazing and I've always wanted to see it and I never have but now I've finally seen it and uh, it's, it's just a camera on the tail, it's nothing major but I just always wanted to see it and it <laughs> looks amazing. Hence the tail cam. Hence the tail on cam. The tail. Camera on the tail. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, Jess is going to show you around this area here. Yeah, got a lot of space. Yeah, she's going to let you know what it's like. So guys, I'm going to show you around our area. Tom's taking his uh, shoes off. Nice so, comfy. yeah, we've got a nice, quite a big, nice, like, TV screen. Um, so if I show you, we'll go to Let's Go, and then you've got all the movies. And I kid you not, there is loads, like, so many. I think, though, I am going to watch Avatar The Way of Water because I haven't seen it yet and I really want to watch it. And if you go back, we've got like TV, shopping, Wi-Fi. And I think that's like the radio. So if you go to, and also Tom was telling me about the tail cam. So if you go to my trip, then you go to tail cam. Look. Yeah. That's and so you cool. you can skip through. It does have, I think and like you can, as well. Yeah, and there's a forward view. So that's amazing. We're flying, I think that's the sea. Is that the sea? That is, that is, that is definitely, it's not, it's not a swimming pool. Yeah, We're sea. flying that over the, the sea. But can I just say, like, how much room there is? Like, I can hardly reach the screen. I have to really lean forward to reach it. But yeah, yeah there is a lot of room. There's a lot of room here. And I think we've flown premium BA before, and I think it's more spacious um, in yeah, Virgin. I agree. But it's lovely either way. And then you go down, and you've got a little footrest, which is nice. And then you've got a little table, and then you've got a menu as well. So if I show you the menu for what we've got to eat. So we've got the starter, which is a salad. Then we've got um, chicken and leek pie, barbecue pulled pork, and spinach and ricotta tortellini. Then we've got dessert, which is passion fruit and mango cheesecake. And then you've got mile high tea or a mile high picnic. There's a little bit of difference between either of those. Um, but yeah, I'm really looking forward to the food. But yeah, I'm I'm really happy, and it's so quiet yeah. on here. And also, there's these in there. Yeah, you've got like um, power. power that's such a yeah. man thing to do. Yeah, there's some, there's some power points in here. Got, such a man thing to do. <laughs> no, that's our life, uh, Jacob. Don't be playing around with that. You do get complimentary earphones as well. Yeah, so you've got earphones yeah. and you've got um, a blanket and a pillow, yeah. but no amenity yeah, kit. Yeah, ours are up in the overhead locker, but no amenity kit um, on this one. But yeah, there's other little touches which I think are quite different to BA, so yeah. Yeah, yeah all good, all happy. <laughs> Waiting for the food now. When it comes out, we'll let you know what it's about. And also, there is a, a wonder wall. You've seen that on the menu, so you can go up there and there's like a few treats and stuff like that. So Yeah, I'm not doing that. That's Tom's job. Uh, but we'll probably catch you when the food comes to see what we've show you what we've got, yep. what we're going to eat, and show then you yeah, I'm going to watch Avatar. What are you watching? I haven't made my mind up yet. Maybe Guardians. Oh yeah, good Maybe choice. Guardians. So the food is in. Jess, you've gone for was it the chicken pie? Yeah, the yeah. chicken pie. So. Alright, isn't it? Yep. 
in a uh, proper bowl, dish. A dish, yeah, and then a little salad. To be fair, the salad does look very, very small, in my opinion. There's a nice dessert here. Is this a mango passion fruit? Yeah, cheesecake. And one of the best things about this is definitely the salt and pepper shakers. Love them. They might be making their way into one of our hand luggage. And then for myself, I've gone for, um, cheers Jess, the pork. Now it sounds good on the menu, but it'll be interesting to see what it looks like. And then if I just open this window, because it might give us some light. There we go. Yeah, she make that out a little bit more. Yeah, that does. That does look alright. It's a little bit dark on there, so you might not be able to make it out, but it does look good. And it does smell very nice. So we're gonna have these and then let you guys know what they were like. Food all sorted. I've now got the uh, forward view up. As you can see, we can't see much at all. And with the tail cam. Yep, we can't see much either, but your food was alright, wasn't it, Jess? Yeah, it was, it was nice. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that was alright. Uh, Just get out your slippers. slippers. Look at them. Something comfy. Stink. So we've got... Bear in mind, we've just had food, so we've got 7 hours and 12 minutes until we arrive. So plenty of time. Plenty of time. I've got some work to do, so I'm going to jump on my laptop and do some of that. Um, Jess is going to watch a film, get her slippers on, have a chill out. Got a cup of tea, my yep. slippers. And the cups of tea here are oh, in. Mug. Yeah, in a proper mug. Do you want to hold yours up? A whole mug. Let it focus. There we go. Look at that. In a proper mug. A mug. So yeah, we're going to uh, sip on our teas. So yeah, we're going to sip on our teas now. And then, uh, Watch a couple of films. We're back on it. It's been a few hours. Yeah, I think the last time we spoke was when we had our meal. We did then have a cup of tea. You've just been watching some films, haven't you? Honestly, Avatar, I'm still watching it. Yeah, you are. We it's, actually. It's three hours and 12 minutes long. It's crazy. And we still, at this current point, we have three hours, 46 minutes left until we land. So we're over halfway now, yeah. I suppose. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so you've been watching some films. I've actually been editing this vlog. I'll just spin it around. This is today's vlog. So it's a bit weird, isn't it? This, this actual vlog. Yeah, Crazy. we're editing this vlog. My mind. We're also making our way through some um, sweets. Yeah, they look great. Sorry about the lighting oh, here, by bad. the way. Like this, like we've had the blind up and down just to find the right lighting, but either way, it's not going to work. You might not better hear us. It's really awkward because everyone's got their blind down. Yeah. Everyone, it's really dark in like, here. Everyone. So we put ours premium. up and we were like, oh god, we're going to wake everyone up. Yeah. But like Jess says, we've got some sweets out now. We did go up to the Wonderwall, but we can be honest, it, it, there's not that much in there. I mean, there is treats in there, but I don't, I don't know what I expected to be fair. But there's, tr there's treats there if you want them. Yeah, I don't really know, no. Um, but yeah, there's enough there if you fancy it. Maybe I just don't fancy it because we've got all these sweets. But yeah, like I say, we are over halfway now, so we are probably going to pick this up towards the end, maybe get some clips of the landing. And well, then, we've got afternoon tea. Oh yeah, we do have afternoon tea, yeah. So we'll obviously show you that. Yeah, I'm not signing off, we're not signing off the flight yet. There's more food to come. So we've still got ages left, mate. Yeah, we've still got ages. So <laughs> yeah, we'll walk you through anything we do do, but we are going to tuck into these sweets now and then show you when the afternoon tea comes out. So this flight is slowly coming to an end. The end is in sight. So we've got an hour and 22 minutes until we arrive. But now, the afternoon tea has landed. You haven't actually gone for anything, have you, Jess? No, sorry, I was a bit yawn then. No, I haven't. I'm not hungry. I'm saving myself for chicken tenders. Yeah, so Jess has saved herself for chicken tenders. If you can't hear her, sorry, obviously the plane's very loud. But she is saving herself for chicken tenders. However, yeah, cup of tea as well. However, I have gone in. I've gone in for... <clears throat> as we can see 
on here, the Mile High Tea. So that's really good. Looking forward to that. I'm mainly looking forward to the salted caramel eclair. But, yep, we'll have a look at this. Let you know what it's, what it's about. I did actually go and look at the Wonder Wall, but all the items have been taken down now, so I'm really sorry for the vlog. You won't be seeing the Wonder Wall. That's not gonna make it on the vlog. But, the afternoon tea has. So I'm gonna tuck into it. So a quick review. The sandwiches were lovely. Really did enjoy them. In fact, we did share them, didn't we, Jess? Yeah, I did help. I did, I did help Tom out. Yeah, we, we did share them in the end. Uh, and then we've had this Battenberg. Is that what it was called? Battenberg. Yeah. Yeah, something Battenberg. This, so the item on the left is what I'm talking about. The yellow one. It, it weren't the best, if I'm being honest. I didn't really like that. It had like a real, real weird taste. But the salted caramel eclair this was outstanding and if you can see full right with caramel that was so nice uh, i am a massive caramel fan as you will see throughout this whole holiday and now we are moving on to the scone scone however you say it depending on where you're from probably but one thing i want to know is with the cream and the jam what do you do first i mean everyone's different I personally go with cream than jam. I know some people think that's controversial, so let me know, let us know in the comments. Mr. Finney, you'll hate that. Let us know in the comments, are you a cream then jam or jam then cream? We have finally made it. We are stepping or standing the on the, yep, the famous Disney carpet. Now you know. Yep, we've also got the Disney wall behind us. You'll be able to see that in the background. Yeah. And then I, I take it that's the Disney store. Well, it, yeah. it says it is, so it is. <laughs> but yep, we're finally here. So absolutely buzzing to have landed. That flight was amazing. Staff were really good, weren't yeah, they? Yeah, they were brilliant. We got a little note from one of, uh, from a couple of the crew actually, which was, it was Callum and Blaze and they were, yeah, they were really on nice. Point. They were lovely. Like I really was, um, nice guys. as I was going for like a little wander, just because your legs get stiff. I was chatting to one of the guys for a little bit, had a nice conversation, then go back to the chair. Obviously, we'd have a chat us, and then uh, we'll go back to the seat and have a chat, and then I'd have a chat with one of the other guys later on. It was really nice, you know, for them to engage. I think with people yeah, on board, and yeah. then for us, they you were know, they were really good. Yeah, definitely break good it. Crew. Yeah, breaking up the journey. It was amazing. Real good Flight experience. Was brilliant. It went really quick. Yeah, it was um, really good. Immigration breezed through it. Yeah, obviously Got we can't. Really quickly. Yeah, obviously we can't record when we're in there. Oh no. As you're coming through, but a bit of luck with our baggage. I've never had this before, and I'll probably never have it again. And I don't think anyone watching this has probably ever had this. But as the bags come off, we've got three bags, and they all came off in a row yeah, together. Yeah, simultaneously. Like, I've they I've all came off. We never were like, seen oh. that in my life. I was like, oh, Tom, that's our bag. Yeah. That's our bag. Oh, that's yeah. our other bag. Like, I've never had that before. I'm probably never have it again. It's usually like one case, and then 10 minutes later, the other one comes off, and then before you know it, you think you've lost your last one. Yeah. But, yeah. No, we had anyway. a, it's been a really good experience. Yeah, it's been a real long day. We are but... going to go down and get an Uber. Yeah. Obviously, Tom's got to sort that out, so I don't know where we're going. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, so I've got to sort out an Uber or a lift. Oh, yeah. Or depending on cheapest. which everyone's cheapest to go towards where we are staying. Uh, and then I would do a price comparison with that on the camera, but obviously, it's going to be quite obvious to where we're going for Jess, certainly. Uh, if I'm doing it on my phone and she's recording it, so it's going to be pretty obvious to where we're going. So I will do two comparisons. I'll tell you which one was cheaper when we get to our resort. Mm. But yeah, it's going to be an exciting one. So we're going to head down now, go and get an Uber or a Lyft, whichever one's cheaper, and then we'll see you guys at a hotel.
So what do you think? I can't believe it. I I'm think actually speechless for once in my life. It's proper crazy, isn't it? I don't know what to say. Do you know what? It was um, when we pulled up at the gate. It was then obvious where we were staying, wasn't it? Because well, it had the, the sign and stuff. The signs, when we were driving in, the signs were like Animal Kingdom Lodge. I was like, oh, he's taking a wrong turn. And, uh, yeah, so here we are. It's crazy. It really is. It is beautiful when it smells good. Yeah, the smells in here are so nice. And look, as you walk through here, it's just incredible. We'll speak more of the room and stuff and about it all but we'll just get ourselves checked in quickly go and find our room we'll go and find that and then uh we'll update you guys about everything but i think you just need to get over this a little bit don't you i'm so tired and speechless it's great. i actually can't i don't i don't know what to say yeah go and get our room we have made it in the room. We are here. Yeah. It was a trek, man, from yeah, reception. It, cer <laughs> it certainly was, but I'm glad we I asked think... um, where our room was because we had no idea. We would never have found nah, it. Nah, nah. It was uh, a long way from the reception, but we've managed to get in here. Jess is uh, just about over the shock of it. it. Yeah, that we're actually in here. It's amazing. It's amazing. And it, what it is as well is with Animal Kingdom Lodge, since we ever first come to Disney, it's always been the hotel you've always wanted to stay at. Yeah, I've always wanted to stay And here. we never thought we'd be able to. And I said on the previous video as well that it was a great deal to be able to come and do this. And it really was. Because we're annual pass holders now, we got 30 to 40% off the hotel. That's and then incredible. Yeah, and then when we looked at the flights, we had enough air mile points just to fly essentially for free we just had to pay the taxes so it is one of the it's still not a cheap holiday florida is never going to be a super cheap no. holiday but you know it's a lot cheaper than it should be as such you know so this is why we've been able to do it this is why we've been able to come here uh with the room as well now you can get a savannah room here yeah and before i even booked it I had a discussion with you about if we ever come here would you want to choose the savannah room you said well maybe it depends obviously on the price after looking at the price, it was double the price. So we haven't gone with a Savannah room. However, the room that we have been given, it looks like we can pretty much see the Savannah anyway. It's called a partial Yeah, a partial a view. Partial view. That's what he said on the um Yeah. And he said desk. it's still a good view, it's just because it's not a full Savannah um view, they can't sell it as a Pools of Anna view, if that makes sense. I'm fine with So that's absolutely view. fine. Like, and I'd be happy fair, with a pool view, I don't care. Yeah, and you know, for how often we're gonna be probably in the room, I'd say it's not really probably it's not probably really worth a savannah room for us, you know. Um but for a family or anyone that wants to wake up and see the animals, absolutely fine, you know. Obviously that would be an amazing experience, isn't mm. it? So but for us, yeah, I think the room that we're, we're in seems as though it's going to be perfect. But we will let you know fine, in the morning. Yeah. What we're going to do is we're going to sign off now. Yep. We are both shattered. Yep. It is it currently is. half past nine, so yeah. it's very late. It is a late one. Been, but yeah. one, one thing I need to touch on quickly, because I said it earlier in the vlog as well, was when we were saying about reservations we had booked... The reason I booked via Napoli is because we get extended hours in the park being in oh, a Disney... Oh yeah, of course um, we do! What, what's the word? Disney Deluxe. Deluxe Resort. When we're in a Disney Deluxe Resort, you do get extended hours. And while we're here, I think there's two or three nights we can get Epcot and there's Magic Kingdom. <gasps> so, yeah, we get to have oh, extended hours. I think it's from sick. like 10pm till... Um, It'll be till from midnight. Park close. Yeah, till yeah, till park two close. Hours till, after. Yeah, I think it's. I can't remember. I looked at the hours before we come out, but yeah. So with Via Napoli, I've timed that so we have that. We can watch the fireworks and then just Carry go around on. the park. Yeah, oh, that's and rides so and cool. rides. So it just makes sense to to do that. I've always wanted um, to be in Napoli as well. Yeah, and the extended hours. Again, it was a great opportunity to come to this hotel. Not only because it's an amazing hotel. And obviously, we will show you around the room tomorrow. We're going to do that we'll, tomorrow. We're going to yeah. do a full room tour, full view. Yeah, that'll be our day one. That will be so, tomorrow. I'm yeah, that'll be, our, now. that'll be on our next vlog. And also, we'll obviously show you around, like, we'll the, show you around, the, around the resort. Around the resort and, yeah, yeah. Show, you, show you the pool and stuff like that. It all looks amazing on videos we have seen. So, yeah. And, um, yeah, it's just going to be obviously great to experience it all and bring you guys along. But for now, I think we're going to sign out because it's out. been a long day. It's now, what, half two, three a.m. 
in the UK. Yeah, we've been up. We've yeah, got it's up like, since five, so we've done. Yeah, really, like, so it's been. You know a, what it's like when you land in Florida. You're just. Yeah. Well, I am just shattered. It's just been such a long day, but it's been a pleasant one. So you got here. We're looking forward to the whole holiday. Mm. We've come into the room. It's got our name on the TV. Probably won't be able to work that out. Oh might, yeah. You might be able to work it out there. So yeah, it's got our name on there. We're all happy. And uh, we're going to set ourselves up nicely so that tomorrow we can get up and go and rope drop uh, Magic, Magic Kingdom. Kingdom. So we'll see you. We'll see you guys. In the next one. In the next one. Bye. Bye.